day two. Here we go. Uh, what am I missing? Seven troops, ten arena, one shove. Okay, we'll do this real quick. Okay, skip. Okay, okay, back to battle. Dun dun dun. Hope everybody's doing okay. This, uh, <sighs> whole family's kind of got a little sick here, so, um, been a little under the weather myself. Uh, not horribly bad though, and uh, doing better now. So, all right, 56 of the season, day two, Celtic in number one. Go Bills. So it looks like these guys are uh, been in the top, hanging out at the top. Looks like Celtic's changed up his form a little bit. And looks like we've got a bunch of people that attacked us. Who's in the number one? Go Bills is number one right now. And he just happened to attack me. So let's see what he is running on uh, defense. He's got a stinking alley in there. You've got to be joking me. Oh, I want to kill this alley. Hmm. I said, hmm, let's go with, let's put our, these guys on the outside. Give this one a shot here. See how this does here for us. Okay. Okay, he missed my Peltas, but oh, his Peltas, he's got a nice Peltas army. The only where, place where his Peltas are alive are around his alley, of course. Oh, too bad. So sad. Now you're dead. Maybe. Oh, maybe I spoke too soon. Oh my goodness. No, we didn't. Okay. That could have been awesome. All right, well, that was the number three guy right there. Let's see who else attacked me. Uh, RGR, God bless Maya. Okay, so I think we know what to do with this. We get our Chion formation in there. And so I'm trying some pumpkins, trying some pumpkins in the back behind the uh, stone golems instead of, uh, instead of the uh, stone golems there. We'll see how the pumpkins do. Give it a shot, here we go. All right, I'm hoping that the pumpkins will be a little bit better at Taking the draw on the fire, maybe. Seeing how that goes for me. Uh, Chion's taking some damage. 3,000 orcs are on her. Eh, this one doesn't look that great. Come on, guys. I think we got this one anyways. Despite all that, I mean, my pumpkins are still alive. Okay, so I was thinking maybe the pumpkins weren't a good idea. But, uh, hmm. The jury's still out on that one. Uh, the pumpkins can really lower the attack so i was the idea behind that if i get my pumpkins in there kind of uh go up there behind the stone golems do their little uh uh lowering defense move um perhaps it'll be help out a little bit who's this uh swb attacked me and he's got an alley in there you guys know how i feel about alley one of my favorites. Um, all right, here we go. Missed my pelt test. It's good. And looks like putting the, um, the RKs there, Rhino Knights, on the outside seemed to be a nice little difference there. So. You can always mess with that. Um, who else attacked me? Mr. Hellhound. Uh, good buddy of mine here. Always good to see what he's working on. So here we go. Uh, going with the Peltas. Guy's got a lot of Peltas in here. Lots of orc hunters. Um, somebody pointed out that my uh, goblin tech versus... Um,
versus the Selene's is pretty much pointless against the uh, Orc Hunters. So let's try that with the, just throw a Voodoo doll in there for, for sheer randomness. All right, so, wow, a ton of Orc Hunters. They are all going after my uh, pumpkins. His rear attack coming on strong. Uh, 256. Uh, wow. Normally, normally their rear attacks don't do that good. Um, so what happened? Uh, I just don't like how the ice does not affect his, his cannons at all either. Okay, let's check out the report here. Um, well, my cannons can't really complain with that. Uh, almost 2 million damage probably with the cannons there. Everyone else just uh, pretty much fell apart. Um, his ballistas did good. I mean, that's about all. His rear attack was kind of what did it, which was a little interesting because wasn't that impressive of a rear attack. Usually my guys can stop that. Um, that's kind of weird actually. So I'm gonna say, hey, that was some RNG. Right? Let's give it another shot here. Well, yeah, all right, here we go. Okay, so we got one magic apprentice pushing my pirate ship up around the outside there. Um, hmm. I don't even know what to say there. Um, okay, so let's do this number here. I'm going to pull two out, put in some pumpkins back here. Dun, dun, dun. Put in my stone golems and put Mr. Goblin Kazi right back in there. See how this one goes down for us. I can't stop his, this is a very insignificant rear attack, so I'm not sure why uh, it's just destroying me or what is going on here. Okay, so um, that appeared to be a little better. Let's check out how the Goblin Techs, uh, not the Goblin Techs, obviously, they did well. They do really good against uh, Selene's. But seeming to put in the pumpkins in the back helped you alleviate that rear attack a little better. So uh, let's uh, look at the report here, see how they did. Still, that rear attack was pretty... So 300,000, so the Goblikazis are still doing some damage in there. They're still hurting those Goblin Techs, even though they're... I mean, Orc Hunters, sorry about that. But wow, that rear, his rear attack, 500,000 for that one. That's not real happy with that. Okay. Let's, uh, let's move on. So we got some losses in there. Maybe we learned something. I don't know. Mr. RGR, Dr. Ram. Take a snap. This one um, looks uh, familiar. I think we beat this guy before as well. This rear attack is... It's just not, I'm not happy with that rear attack doing that to me like that. Usually that doesn't happen. My cannons, 
I don't understand what's happening right now. This is really kind of bogus. Just... Okay, this is weird. The pumpkins didn't really even seem to do anything there. I have a 10 man uh, rear attack that's coming at him. Is he killing my, um, is he killing my stone golems? I'm not sure what's happening. My stone golems are still alive. Um, man, that's just, just coming on like gangbusters there. It's just good night. Are you joking me? All right, well, mine did too, so holy cow. About the only things left are the stone golems. That's how it should have been. So, I mean, if your rear attack's staying alive, mine's too, so I don't know what the heck. Okay. <sighs> Just some weirdness there. So it looks like I'm about 50-50. Well, ish on the stupid trash uh, split stone golem ones. And those the stone golems stay alive there, so they're tough to kill. Um... All right, yeah, that's great. Got promoted. Uh, who else is next here? USA, probably with a... What is that? That's a Siondioc in there. Okay, we can take Siondiocs, I'm pretty sure. He doesn't look like he's got anything that's going to kill my stone golem super fast, so my uh, rear attack should be... Should be pretty effective. Um, unfortunately, it looks like my not really doing anything to his rear attack either. What the heck is that? Uh, she attacks the three guys on the right-hand side. And, uh, man, his rear attack just... Uh, something's changed. Okay, something has changed in the game dynamics here. Uh, this, is, this is not normal. There's something, something is different right now. And uh, I can sense it. He's got a 16 one-star Siondioc, and it just wiped out the entire, all my guys. And that's not normal at all. Um, hmm. Okay, this... This looks like, I mean, does, what the actual heck? He doesn't even have, he's only got one 10 stone golem, and he just, he's got a two, four, six, eight man, uh, nine, ten. A decent rear attack, but still, I mean, there's no way. Why? What the? What the actual heck? Well, his guys just like pushed my, my uh, Rhino Knight. We just like herded them backwards somehow. That was pretty crazy. They were like the Rhino Knights just uh, kind of got stopped and killed right away. Um, interesting. So I don't think we're going to win this one either. One cannon left. Somehow uh, has just managed to kill all my cannons. And uh, it's 83 on 9, but I don't know if, well, okay. Somehow managed to get the uh, the win there, maybe. <sighs> I just don't understand how this trash uh, forum beat me. It literally has like a uh, level 9 uh, stone golem in there. What the actual heck? Darn it, I want to look at that guy's forum. I'm like, <sighs> 37 kg. Okay. Let's see how this one holds up against uh, Chion. There goes Yasha, stunning all the Peltas single-handedly. Oh my gosh. Rear attack is just... Uh, something's going on. Something's different today, guys. Uh, just coming on like gangbusters... I mean, you, this is a joke right now. 
This is stupid. Um, this is so stupid. There's no way. <sighs> so, okay, so... Just didn't have an answer for that, apparently. All his uh, guys just stayed alive. Uh, didn't even hurt his Rhino Knights. Managed to go back there and just kill everybody. Um... Okay, anytime you want to finish me off there, buddy, that's great. Trash. Um, stinking garbage, man. Okay, so we got... Split stone golem. Okay, this can take these, right? I believe so. Let's give this one a shot here. Oh no, his his stone golems come in and he's just gonna kill me. His rear attack just coming on like gangbusters though. Alright, we got four stone golems still alive though. Meteor golems, I'm sorry, as well. Get in there and kill this dude, you piece of trash. Okay, it looks like we got this guy. Um Getting super unlucky here, guys. Uh, there's something's changed. Something about the rear attack. Because sometimes uh, stone golems weren't dying, and the rear attack was still being attacked. So it looks like that's changed back. But it's still something funky's going on right now that's not really normal. Um, can't really put my finger on it. All right, normally this is a fairly 50-50 win for me. Let's uh, see how we're doing here. So see if the Goblikazi actually does some damage here. We'll try to check that if I can remember. Um, blast, what the actual heck? Um, something's definitely different. Um... I think we're going to win this, but still. Uh, usually my rear defenders hold up a lot better than that. And it's because the cannons don't really care where they attack. They can attack the rear, uh, the rear attackers. They'll just kind of attack whoever. They don't, have, they don't target fixate on the front like some other things do. Range doesn't seem to target fixate. Like uh, melee and other things do, so... Oops, almost forgot to check out my report here. So, Gabakazi 1.5, 157. Not horrible, but I don't know. Once again, the cannons are doing all the work. I wonder if I, uh, I'm going to try something since my uh, other cannons. <coughs> Excuse me. Let's try, uh, we're still in the experimentation phase here of playing the game, so... Uh, okay, so what I was going to do, let's just switch places here with those guys, see if that... Uh, <coughs> excuse me, see if that makes a difference here. All right, here we go. Maybe just get those uh, cannons out of the way, perhaps being protected a little bit more from that rear attack. Eh, we'll see. Looks like the left side's holding up pretty good. Uh, 74 on 30. Uh, Chion, don't die. Of course. Uh, why wouldn't she go commit suicide? Why is my Chion suicidal? Okay, it doesn't matter. Goodbye. Okay, that seemed to work out pretty good. Just switching those guys there. All right, let's check out the report. See. Um, so still good. 600,000 for that. The left side really held their own. And looks like pulling up that those... Uh, meet, uh, can't talk. Pulling up those guys seemed to help a little bit. All right, um, 
Moving on. Let's see. 36. Kill spider. All right. If we don't just absolutely walk over this guy, I'm going to be really amazed. So I'm going to try it with my uh, orc hunters up there. I'm sorry. Goblin techs up there and see if that is any different. This guy is absolutely stomping me. What did I say? If we don't just destroy this guy, something's going on. Okay, we did kill his... Uh, we killed his Selene. Um, and I thought this was just going to be an absolute uh, murder, death, kill. But uh, he came on pretty strong there. And, uh, well, we're going to be able to finish him off here. But it wasn't wasn't like I was expecting. I was expecting, um, I think his, I was expecting a little better from my guys there, actually. All right, Kerr now. Okay. Um, what is that picture? Is that guy like Aleister Crowley or something? I don't know. Anyways, um, <laughs> sorry. Okay, this one might give me some trouble. Uh, it's got meteor golems on the side. So those, they act real funky, and they tend to um, ignore the stone golems. No, you're going to make a liar out of me. Oh, my gosh. Okay, so scratch what I just said. I was like, usually meteor golems on the sides, they'll ignore the stone golems in the middle and they'll just go attack um, those guys. Uh, yeah, this is going to be, I don't think we're going to win this one. He's got Sion, unless Sion Diak, what the actual heck, uh, unless Sion Diak dies here. How? Who killed Sion Diak? Are you joking me? Wow, we got lucky. I don't even know who killed Sion Diak. Because I thought he was just going to sit there and heal his guys while he destroyed me. But I uh, managed to work out. Um, what I was saying about the meteor golems on the side, usually they just uh, charge forward and uh, just disregard the stone golems in the middle. But then, of course, they made a liar out of me and just didn't do that. So sometimes I avoid those uh, particular Siondioc forms. All right. So this one... This one. Let's give it a shot. Okay. I don't know why. Holy cow. This is, oh my gosh. Crash on a shingle, man. All right, what, what? Where's split? There's my split. Kills mid SG. Does it? Um, let's give this one a shot. Uh-oh. Killed your stone golem before you killed mine. There we go. Goodbye. See you later, buddy. Nice knowing you. All right. So that's why I have that one. Uh, that's my one for killing uh, Chion's as well. If they have a single or multiple stone golems in the middle, it's pretty tough to stop that. Uh... You gonna give me anybody that's like higher ranked? Okay, Monkey D. Luffy. All right, this one's this one's no joke, actually. Um, hmm. Normally, my Chion has been doing well versus those, but they're I mean, my Chion just not stopping. Uh, this attack right now. I'm not sure why. Uh, I wonder, what if I pull two and put in pumpkins? Would that do anything or would that just... Dun, dun, dun. I'm not sure. For some reason, Jin's rear attack is nasty. 
All right, let's 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 see. I'm still not exactly sure on Jin's range of his buff. It doesn't seem like it's that much, but then when I look at how his uh, rear attack's coming on super strong, it uh, makes me wonder who exactly is getting the buff and who isn't. All right, looks like... Um, it, yeah, looks like we destroyed him, so... Um, pretty, uh... Pretty decisive there, which is weird, because Jin, he's a lot of RNG with Jin. All right, so this is a normal, uh, this should be just a beat down here. Yeah. And as a viewer pointed out, the we're going to check out my uh, Gabakazis back there, see how, how well they did against those orc techs. Doesn't look like, I don't know, see what kind of damage they're doing. So at the end of season uh, 45, we pretty much did not lose a single one of these against these. And look at, I don't know, there's something's going, something's a little weird right now. My, um, my left side of the cannons are absolutely just not dying. They're just throwing down cannons like there's no tomorrow. And the right side is getting hammered. We did get the win there. Let's check out the report here. Abakazi, 164,000. Look at the cannons. They did uh, They did pretty crazy. And that's pretty crazy, too, because uh, the left side was like all cannons were alive. My right side had like four cannons, and somehow those four cannons did uh, 1.2 million, and I don't know. Some weird stuff going on. Let's see how his uh orc hunters did not like crazy damage so maybe the gabakazis did kind of whittle them down a little bit not great damage there for orc hunters me love yunje all right here is a a chion and Interesting, a strong looking formation, but uh, his stone golem should die in about 1,000, 2,000, 3,000. Dead yet? Okay, dead. And interesting. That's. Did he, he didn't kill my stone golem, so how did he just, how did he kill my rear attack? I, uh, this is bull crud. That's what it is. It's bull crud. You can't do that. You can't stop my, you didn't kill my, my stone golems are still alive. And you just annihilated my rear attack? This is trash. There's something's going on here. That was a complete garbage. <sighs> Get back in there. This is bull crud on a shingle, man. You can't just blow up my rear attack like that. All right, let's give this another go here. Yeah, now now I uh, destroy him. Somehow his cannons and everything are just still alive. Just kill him already. This piece of trash form. I mean, it's actually pretty good, but just trash. Get it out of here. There's no way I should have lost to that garbage. Um, good golly. I don't know what the heck I just said. Okay, we're going to try to redeem our form here. Last couple times we did split splitters. Um, had some bad luck. Here we go, because I had my sticking uh, pell test up in the front there. So uh, let's see how this one goes down. Not looking real great. These guys are coming, uh, coming on pretty strong there. Um, anybody's game still. Not so much anymore. Um, yeah, that's awesome. That was awesome. 
That was awesome. Ugh, stupid piece of garbage. Just kill me already. If you're going to do it, just do it. I mean, good golly. Any time here. All right, that's really ticking me off. Um, he killed all my guys instantaneously. He didn't kill his somehow. Funny that. Usually that's no problem. Let's uh, let's try that again here, buddy. All right. Hmm. What if? What if I use a couple of my own little guys there? Ready? All right, go fight, win. They're not going and fighting and winning, though, are they? You piece of trash. So, mm, so you're so dumb. This is so stupid. Now, all of a sudden, uh, I can't beat this. This is so garbage mm. okay that's really stupid um mister all right so somehow I'm just unable to stop that that's super special this guy gets his stun in Just don't understand. That doesn't even look that good. Yeah. What is that? What is that behind the cannons there? Okay. This doesn't even look like it should beat me, really. Ten. Um... It's just insta killing my guys. Normally this uh, this one beats them, but uh, it's not having the desired effect here. Somehow he's just killing my guys as well in the back there. <sighs> okay. Um. No, we're not doing that. What's going on here? Okay. All right. Um, how about this little number here? Uh-oh, buddy. Oh, no. What happened? Did you die? That's too bad. How do you like them apples? Huh? A little bit of your own medicine there, buddy. You guys died, like, instantaneously. How about that? Okay. So, a little bit of change of rearranging, and uh, managed to fix that guy's wagon. We got 49. Uh, 35. Okay, stinking alley. All right, so we mixed up our alley a little bit. Oof. Put them on the outside. Here we go. All right. Let's see. See if that helps us or not. I don't really like how our Peltas just kind of got in one little spot there. Uh, but appears that his alley's in trouble, maybe. Oh, wait. Never mind. No, she's not. Even though the stun goes down. Please kill her. Anybody. Three dollars. Oh boy. We're not gonna win this, are we? We are not going to win. He's got he's got we have to win this. There's no way this trash beats me. Good night. Not liking how my oh there we go. Peltas get in there and kill that stupid demon. 
Hello? <clears throat> this is 10 minutes left. All right, 10 minutes. Anytime. Anytime. That's maybe why uh, people put in their alleys because um, I don't think a lot of people want to fight them towards the end because they they can tend to uh, last a long time and not die. So, okay, here we have an Arthur. Interesting. And we've gone up against an Arthur for a while, and we're going to throw in our uh, Chion here to see if we can't just mess this one up with our cannons. Cannons unite. Wow, so both those meteor golems just straight up took shots from the cannons and didn't get stunned in the least. At least Chion's being protected there by the cannons, and it looks like we're probably going to mop this one up. Although Arthur is alive, and uh, he's going to have to really do some uh, special work here not to die. Like hero trial type work. Uh, didn't matter. Down he goes. You don't see a lot of Arthurs in the top, and he just can't seem to compete. Here's a stinking alley, and we'll give it a shot here. All right. Oh, I didn't put my Celine on the alley side. Perhaps that's going to be bad for me. I don't know. Okay, guys are spreading out. That's good. If the more guys, my guys are spread out, the difficult it is for stupid alley to kill all of them. Although that was not a bad job of doing so. Eight minutes left. How many fights do we have left? I don't know. I've been wasting some time on some dumb uh, fights, as usual, in the early part of the season and towards the late. I'm trying to correct that. Uh, here we go. 476 guy. Oh, right. Where's that one we just used to absolutely destroy them? Here we go. Hopefully, we're going to repeat that little uh, miracle. And say goodbye to this guy. Oh boy, it's close. Of course, his rear attack is just coming on like like the Donkey Kong. You piece of trash, you piece of garbage. Get your rear attack out of here. Okay. Good night. I guess just tried to just in, implode on me. And there we go. Took him out that time. Mm, winger, who's this guy? Stinking alley. Here we go. Oh yeah, of course he hits my peltas. Um, no one's attacking alley. This is really bad for us. My army's kind of splitting up. That's good. Ali just killed all my Peltas. That's bad. My Peltas are being stupid. No one's attacking Ali. We're going to die. Oh, boy. Here we go. Go get him, more Hunters. Kill. Fight. Go fight. Yes. Down she goes. Amazing. Got a win there. Okay. That was uh, not uh, luck. That was pretty lucky there. Here's Mr. Warrior Prince. All right. What do you got there, buddy? interesting um this should this should be just uh absolutely destruction but like i said this rear attack has been a lot there's been a little bit of difference here lately and it's tough for me to put my finger on it um his celine had li literally zero health and just got hit by chion and okay died there we go that's uh, that's normally what happens Every single stinking time I fight that form, and that's how it should be. The consistency should be there. Okay, Celtic, what's you got there, buddy? I don't fight Celtic, but I do check out his form. Monkey D. Luffy. Well, we did pretty good against that one last time. Let's give it another shot here. Um... Okay, looks like my cannons are doing okay. Still got all of his peltas in there. And Chion's trying to get killed. She's going to die. That's just special. You idiot. You complete moron. 
Well, he's going to beat us now. Um, somehow he just managed to just steamroll me, killed my uh, ten magic apprentices in the rear, and just ran me over with this piece of trash form. Bullcrud. All right, let's give this one a go here. Piece of garbage. All right, you know what? I'm going to sacrifice one of my rear attackers because they're not doing anything anyways. And let's try this one again. Okay, pretty much should have killed all his orc hunters. Uh, yeah, this is... Yeah, of course not. Of course, I mean... <laughs> Bullcrud, man! This is so stupid! There's no way! There is no stinking way that you just evaporate all of my rear attackers and then all his Peltasts are still alive. This is so stupid! It's a piece of crud form out of there, dude. Let's see how you like. See no, crud. Why'd I do that? Probably gonna get just butchered. Siondiak doesn't do well against Jin, I don't think. It's, it's, oh. Come on, boys. Come on. Stupid Jin. What a piece of trash. This is so stupid. Oh my gosh. This is not even... I mean, what the heck is actually going on here? We're, mm. <sighs> okay. Why do I always have to run into some piece of garbage form that I can't... I just... I literally just beat this one. Then now I can't beat it. Alright, that's it. Let's sacrifice that. This should be able to kill all his guys there. Here we go. There shouldn't be any orc hunters left. There aren't. His rear attack, I mean, this is so stupid. Die, piece of garbage! Just kill his stupid gin at least so he doesn't get... Uh, you're dead, you're dead! You piece of garbage! Just killed his entire trash form. How about that? I know, oh, now all my cannons want to live. Like, so stupid. There's no way. I was so dumb. 58. Uh, sure, why not? Let's fight this guy. Uh, didn't appear to hurt his orc hunters in the, the slightest. Yeah, what the actual trash... How many orc hunters did this guy even have? I didn't even look. This is stupid. What the heck? <sighs> okay, this is so dumb here. He only had five. Um, you know what, dude? You're dead. You're a dead man. Dead man walking. In comes my split stone golem, Siondiak, to just absolutely crush your dreams and crush your little orc hunters and your rhino knights and just destroy them look at that death first okay well at least i uh if anything good came out of this i found a pretty good formation seems to just handle the stupid split stone golem uh, uh scenario so Two fights left, one... Okay, come on, Chion, do your thing. Oh, crud, what am I doing? I don't have time, I don't have time, I don't have time! Where's my guys? What do I have in there? I don't have time, it's time for reset. I'm gonna put in a demon in there. What if we do this? Three, two, one, go. We're going to leave a fight on the table. It's already four. Dang it. <sighs> well, let's see how this one pulls off for us. So I just added another ghost assassin in there in lieu of a uh, Kazi.
and it looks like we're going to pull it off. So uh, mess with some forms a little bit. Uh, we can tweak here and there. Uh, just kind of look at your opponent's forms. Uh, yeah, not not my greatest run. This uh, stupid Jin. Jin's got a lot of RNG guys. It's it's tough to uh, deal with that. Of course, that one went chalked it up to the second uh, battle there, and I missed my scroll. Anyways, my friends, uh, thanks for watching this one, and uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow.